Hey everyone, today we're going to be talking about our laser cutting system. I know we've talked about this in a couple of our other videos, but I wanted to go more into a detailed description of what we're doing and what is the laser and how we go through the whole process. Right now I have Cody here. He's uh, putting on a new roll of uh, labels and he's getting ready to splice this on to the other roll that we had here. And we're gonna go through the whole entire process and we'll walk you step by step through the whole entire thing. Cody just spliced on the roll. What we call a splice is when we take a, our tape here and we join the two rolls together. So he's getting ready to move through this job and put it through our laminate. And before we start running the job, we always check to make sure that we're putting on the right laminate for the right job. This one's gonna be changing over to a matte laminate instead of a gloss. So right now we have a gloss on there and you can kind of see it has this clear look to it and a shiny look where the matte, we'll see it has more of a frosted look and on the top side it has this uh, kind of satin matte soft finish on there. So you'll see the difference as we go through here. Okay, so now you can see that he's uh, put on matte lamination and this has, like I was saying, this frosted look and you'll see on the other side the labels as they kind of come through the other side what it actually looks like when you put in matte lamination and what the textured feel will look like on there as we do it. And how we, how we do this is it comes off this roller, comes down here, and then it comes onto this nip roller where it takes it and it marries the two materials together and it sticks to each other and it has a nice strong bond with the pressure of the roller that we put on there. All of our files are kept on our computer here and when we send them over to this computer. And as you can see, it has, uh, right now it has 321 different die line files in the system at this time. And what happens is we take the size and the shape of your sticker or label and we send it over to this computer. And this computer then will take this and use this as the, as the shape to cut on the laser chamber that it has over here. And we'll go through the whole entire process as you can kind of see us moving through this. So he selects the file for this specific job and you can see it pulls up the, the laser file and the cut lines that it wants to cut on here. And as he goes through, he double checks it, his paperwork, to make sure that's what it is, that way he needs. And then we'll move through and load the file onto the laser for it to get ready to fire. This file here, as you can kind of see, they're blank cut lines on here. We use these cut lines to dial in the cut to the exact spot on the label where it needs to get cut. So we use these kind of almost like a calibration marker. And you can kind of see it leaves these lines on here. So then when it comes to the actual print of the job, we know exactly where the cut lines are supposed to be when a cut comes through. And another thing that's cool about this system is every single one of these eye markers that we have on here are to let it know, let the machine know to fire the, the laser cut. So when it sees this eye marker, it shoots out the laser, does its cut, and it waits for the next eye marker to hit again, and then just does its cut again. And what, what's really cool about that is that we can go from this shape to then hypothetically another shape, so from like a rectangle to a circle, from this eye marker to this eye marker. And that's all controlled by either manually putting it on the computer, as you saw Cody do, or we can put a bunch of them in there at once, and these barcodes right here, they have an, a unique ID code, so then the computer knows what file to cut. And it can go from one size to the next without even stopping the machine. So it makes it really easy for us to get a lot of jobs done and very quickly get them done. Before we start here, I wanna talk about the laser chamber and actually what is, what is laser cutting in general and what does it actually do? So laser cutting, Basically, it takes a CO2 laser and it comes down as a beam and starts cutting the material. And the longer you leave the laser in one spot, the deeper it'll start to cut through. So that's why we're able to do labels and stickers at, and on the same exact machine here. And it all depends on how long we're cutting it. So if you look in the laser chamber here, this is where all the magic happens. And the actual laser actually sits in the back of the machine. And what happens is when the computer tells the laser to fire, it comes in and hits a mirror. And when it hits the mirror, the mirror actually moves. And as the laser is hitting the mirror and reflecting off and bouncing down into the chamber here, the mirror moves 
in essence makes the reflection of it change whatever shape it needs to. So you have a mirror in there that's moving really fast to create a shape. And that's all being done, being told by the computer to how the how it needs to move, how fast it needs to move, how slow or slow. And that's how we create a laser cut file on here. And that's actually what we're talking about when we talk about laser cutting. This is the process of how it happens. So then the laser is firing off the die cut lines that we were showing there earlier. And you can kind of see the laser beam actually cutting the material. Another thing that's really cool about this is that we don't have to buy dies like most companies have to buy dies. So most traditional label companies or sticker companies buy a metal tool that costs extra money to then cut your labels or stickers. We don't have to do that here. And what's the advantage of doing that is that we're able to get jobs out a lot quicker than most people can. We can cut it on the fly like this. And also the, the, the cost for a tool, sometimes it costs up to $500 just for one tool. And you're into a cost of 500, at least $500 before you even print or cut one label or sticker, where we're able to do it without adding extra cost to your labels or stickers and also do it faster. So that's another really cool benefit of having a laser here. And also the shipping and the extra cost and the environment, which we all very much care about. Uh, it, it makes it uh, the, the impact on everything a lot less. So it's a very cool tool and we're super excited about it and it speaks for itself. So as this is cutting, it cuts through the chamber here and we're, only, we're telling the machine only to cut the top layer. So what happens when we tell it to only cut the top layer is it actually cuts just the, the top layer of the material here, but it leaves the liner, the carrier, to come all the way through the system for labels. And it takes the extra or the scrap material and winds it all up into this roll here. So then at the finished product that you see down here is the actual die cut of the label. And as this job's finishing out, you'll see how these die cut lines of what the cut line should look like. Now this job was cut on a, uh, this material was a clear label material with a matte laminate. This job gets put onto a roll, and as in our other videos, as I was talking about the rewinder that we have, then this job goes over to the rewinder, goes through the inspection system, and then gets finished and packed, just like you saw in Amber's video earlier, of her packing the job, and this goes out the whole entire process. So this is actually like the middle part of our whole entire process. So we go from artwork to digital printing, to then over here to laser cutting, and then rewinding, and then shipping, and then it goes out the door. So that's the whole entire process as we do it. And this is like right in the middle. This is kind of the meat, meat and potatoes of the whole entire operation as we do things. And it's a, it's a really cool setup. It's a really cool system. And it really helps us get these jobs done really quickly, very accurately. And not just labels we can do, we can also cut stickers as well. And that actually comes off onto this conveyor belt here when we would do a setup a sticker system we would drop this system up here and then it shingles over to this and then we're picking up stickers off this table here and counting them. So it's a really cool fast setup that we're able to do with this machine and we really like it. So this was our laser cutting system. I hope you really enjoyed the video and make sure to check out our other videos that we have on our channel. And don't forget to subscribe and like our videos. Thank you very much.